Ben Wright, let's take you into your stance. As the bowler's running up, what's going through your head? Um, I mean, it totally depends on which sort of uh, situation the game's in. Um, you know, towards the back end, it's it's trying to read what I think he's going to do. You know, you look around for the fields and and try and almost you know get a, you know further ahead of what he is. Um, but then at the same time, you've also got to try and give yourself um, you know more options than than what you sort of are having to guess at what he's going to come at you with. Um, you know, whether that be where you start in the crease, um, deep, you know, further out, more across your stumps or come more leg side of it. And, I mean, you're not someone who triggers. There's a lot of batters who sort of move their feet before. You actually stand dead still. But then also your hands move quite a lot. The bat lift sort of goes up, down, yeah. up again. I mean, is that almost like your trigger movement? Um, I mean, the, the only thing sort of trigger movement-wise that I have is, is my back foot. I mean, it sort of tends to come to, to the leg side, so I like to stand on middle stump like this, and then, you know, every now and again, it'll, it'll sort of creep across like that. Um, that's more of a natural thing, you know, it's, it's not something that I do on purpose. It's just one of the things that happen. I'm trying to give myself extra room. Um, but, yeah, hands, um, you know, I think my hands is just sort of a... Um, you know, a mental thing, um, just to you know keep going and, and keep the flow, everything like that. And you know, I rely a lot on my hands with the, the speed that I try and, and, and get through with them, which I do a lot of work of on as well. And, and that almost so the faster the bowler. Sometimes I've seen your hands tend to move faster in your pickup. Yeah. yeah, I think that's sort of uh, when my beans get going a little bit. Um, it's, just, it's just making sure you know I know it's going to be fast and. Um, yeah, and I'm also sort of premeditating that it's going to be short because the guys are bowling quick. So whether that's that's probably the the thing why my beans start get going and my hands start going everywhere. All right, let's talk about the pull shot. So I mean, you have a little step back, but then you always look like even when it's short, you're trying to come at the ball. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, the, the pull shot's one of the the um, you know one of the massive strengths of my batting. Um, and it sounds daft, I reckon, but you know when I'm first in, and even when I'm you know been in for a long time, I'm I'm almost thinking right, the ball's going to be short regardless. Um, and then you know I'm in, I feel like I'm in a good mental frame of mind to be able to actually you know play the pull short, or if it's too short, just to get out of the way, and then react to anything else um, if it's not short. And that's something that I like to do is just almost like right, if it's short, then um, play it from there, and then as I said, just react to anything else if it's not. And in any format, are you almost looking at four three two one or six four three two one or just watch the ball? What's going through your mind? Um, not a lot really. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm always trying to be um, sort of aggressive and attacking, but you know, not getting too far ahead of myself. You know, when I do get into that frame of mind, I, I tend to get myself out in silly ways, as you know, quite a few people have seen over the last few years. Um, but yeah, it's it's one of the things. If you if you're in a clear mind of of being attacking and, and trying to put the pressure on the bowler, then you, you sometimes can you know get off to a good start by hitting a few boundaries without really thinking about it because it just happens. There's a lot of times where I played a shot and thought I haven't actually meant to do that. Um, it's just happened, and I guess that's just from the frame of mind I take into batting. Yeah, I mean, I think positive cricket is sometimes there's a misunderstanding yeah. amongst people about it. Actually, just being positive means you're looking to move well and looking to go at the ball, but not being reckless. I mean, that's something that you would never really want to see you not doing, really. No, definitely. I mean, you know, it's not all about hitting fours and, and sixes. You know, there's times as a, from me bowling as well when a guy comes out and, you know, plays a, you know, a, a solid forward defence, albeit straight out the middle of the bat, and it goes off to, you know, mid-off or mid-on as fast as a, as a, you know, normal straight drive would, then you're almost like, oh, this, you know, it's his first or second ball and, he, and he's doing that. So he's looking to be positive. So it almost puts you on the back foot and makes you... Um, you know, switch on tomorrow. No, you've got to be more switched on as a bowler with your areas. So that's something that I try to look to do as a batsman as well. Right, now I'm going to throw you some, so go easy on me. Yeah. Ben's gone down into net. He's going to show us a drill that he does to warm up. Ben, what are you doing here? Uh, this is something I do, like, time to time before, um, you know, range hitting sort of stuff. I just try and keep my feet as still as possible and, and use my hands because, um, you know, as I said before, that's a sort of big part of me is hand speed and stuff, so this just helps me doing it, so... All right, okay, so you just want like half volleys. Pressure. Oh. I thought you were just going to pat them back. Oh. oh, that's my fault, that. <laughs> yeah, one more. One more. Good throws, mate. So that's his drill done. Now I'm going to give him some normal throwdowns where he's going to smash the ball a bit. Now, Trevor Bayliss has had to start wearing a helmet because of the way that this bloke hits the ball back. So I've got his helmet. Hopefully he's not going to hit me. <laughs> Never thought I'd see the Dows wearing a helmet giving throws. 
Oh, good Yorker. Should have bowled that in the final, shouldn't I? <laughs> I actually can't see through this helmet. These new helmets, I could not get used to them at all. Shot. Right, last couple. Shot. See, I'm being a little bit of a coward because I'm just throwing it straight on his pads. Oh, That's Schnick, deal. thank you. <laughs> Last ball. Finish on a good one. Right. Ben, thank you so much. Best of luck today and the rest of the summer. Thanks, mate.